Hey people, Mason A here with Just Cause Free the Varium Sea Heist. Last time I failed epically in trying to get this generator thing from the Black Hand tethered to this helicopter and and I didn't even think to try to do it myself. At least you guys got some entertaining fails to witness. Okay, let's try this again. Have I have more experience with tethering stuff to the bottom of helico this helicopter than you may think. I'm, I'm really liking this music right now, but it's totally out of place. What the heck? Oh, and of course, I don't have the liberty of getting the one with Nitro like I should have. Okay, it's gonna be pretty boring. Why am I s What have you been up to? Nothing really, just commandeered a black hand boat. Well, hmm. The rocket boat is due out here. It's meant to attack and wreak havoc. It's the Rico boat. Hey. I'll take that as a compliment. It's almost finished, and why are you telling me that you need more time? I brought you one of those voice modulators the Black Hand uses. Oh, nice. What? <laughs> okay, this. At least now, you can take. He wants to hard. Just like, this game really looks amazing. You know, I think I should screenshot this, because it actually looks. Incredibly good. You know what? I will. Did that? Okay, that didn't seem to work. Oh, well, okay, now it worked. Okay, it worked too well. God, I've been going so f I mean, This is like stealth music and all I'm doing. Okay. Where even is the generator? Okay. I should probably just drop it into the water. Because like, I don't want his stuff. Oh. Oh, cutscene trigger. Wow. Wait for it. The Luchador. Ah. So, let's head over to the Stingray and see what those black hands are. That's a great plan. If you want to die. What did she say? She said, drive safe. <laughs> you know me. Oh, yeah. um. Sheldon, you want to chime in here? Well, this is what we know. There are five satellite stations surrounding Stingray base, heavily guarded by the Black Hand. Not sure how that works exactly, but they act as safety system for that big atmosphere modulator on top of the base. Unless we get the data from them, any unprotected access is suicide. So what's the plan? Take the rocket boat and knock out those stations. Then the real work begins. You mean with the luchador? Not a problem. Hey, luch, what's in that box? Yeah. <laughs> Did you just turn p to freaking papyrus there for a moment? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get dislike on from the Undertale reference, even though it's a freaking great game, not 
Shinsei, I just had no, I just had no idea what else to say. Okay, mission complete. The setup. Luchador. Luchador is now blocked as appears in, in the vehicle in your rebel drop list. Heck yes. Okay, uh, so I got to liberate a base. Stingray, uh, okay, so let's see. Uh, liberate the entire area. Okay, okay. It's, this is just like the other DLC. Okay. Let's place a waypoint here. And I'm going to bring the rocket boat over here. And let's test it out. And I'll liberate a base or two if I have enough time. Okay, let's go. Okay, now that we're on calm waters, let's test my theory from our, earlier. Can this break? Okay, so it's got mini guns and... Oh, I like this a lot. Can this break one? Can this? Oh, I've been going the wrong direction. Whatever. Okay, let's go. Guarda Contrabandera. Okay, I was right. But the, I mean, seriously. Okay, if you want... Yeah, eh. If you want to be undercover, then please, I would strongly advise that you literally, that you do not quite literally name, uh, your freaking outpost, a uh, contraband cave, because that is what it means, that is what Guado Contrabandero means. Oh my god. No wonder these rebels got freaking assaulted in that one mission, at least it was a very, very fun mission. So do I. Well then, okay, let's just call in a new one. Well, that was not good. Well, that didn't go well at all. No, no, I didn't want to tether underwater. Gosh darn it. Okay, so... Jeez, okay, um... Oh, wait, let's check the stats on this thing. So, full speed, almost full power, and ag full agility, um, solid armor, but blows up really easy when land. And, of course, no big surprise, full combat capability. So, let's head out. Okay. Oh god, this is gonna be so awesome. Oh, okay, I was right. It just pished. You're gonna be you're gonna be in the air so much you can't push that speed. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is fast. I'll stop referencing that song right now, even though I freaking I'm very nostalgic for Sonic X. Oh, jeez, oh, it's slowing down so much because it just can't. And of course, it has insane recharge speed as well. Oh god, I wouldn't. But if you have this, you see, I would not advise using this for challenges because it's just too fast. The Pepiscata SS or whatever the other real, really fast boat is, the one that has a weaponized version that you get with the pre order version of the game, edition of the game, it's, it is a very good boat. And it doesn't go absurdly fast. Oh, no. Wait, why am I even worrying? I can blow the crud out of anyone that dares to approach me. And they can't even catch me. So I'm pushing... I was just pushing... Oh, 150. Almost 160 kilometers per hour. My goodness gracious. Okay. And I'm not even sure what that is in miles per hour. I'm pretty sure it's like... Okay, what would be 40% more than that? I'm not gonna do the math right now, I gotta focus on the game. Uh, something over 200 miles per hour, that's for sure. Okay, it's gonna take freaking forever, what the heck? This Nitro is actually just un- like so un- so just broken 
Like, what are these people, and why are there so many civilian boats out here, not just a kilometer away from military bases? Um, that's a tad bit dangerous, if I do say so much stuff. Entering the province of Stingray area. Oh, that's just the- Oh, that's the crash tower they were talking about. Okay, so not gonna liberate that. This base probably has something of interest. Alright, so sorry this episode's been a bit boring, just spending most of my time just driving. Well, at least you can see the combat capabilities of the Luchador. Well, it's not technically in action, but you know that it has like an unfairly long mini. Okay. Man overboard. Oh! Okay, let's okay, got the fuel thing. I'm gonna get up I'm gonna go get on. Oh that's pretty far oh that looked too far back to you. Climate controller. This thing is just too reliable. It's actually kind of broken. It's just it's very risky to use in close quarters. Um, like, not that that's a big surprise to anyone. And if you use it, you're in utter explosive objects, well then you are just done for. Hey, uh, hey, can you help me out here, helicopter buddy? Gosh darn it. Miko's just like, what? I just love his, like, oh god, I just love that expression. Hijacking 101. Military vehicles can't be hijacked until the passengers take a hike. Kill the guards first, then you can unlock the driver. Yeah, most, some of these tips are just downright useless, but other of them are really useful. Like, I didn't know you could push down on the left stick to get, like, when you're, like, in a rebel vehicle to get a military vehicle to get um, rebels to get in and if you didn't know that well now you do oh yes my ammo's been restocked okay I missed don't know how you can really miss with a new launcher at close range but I guess I'm just a screwable wait what what wait what is this collectible that is within my proximity or vicinity, or whatever. And this collectible does in proximity. If there is this bus I'm looking for in the middle of the ocean, then I am not going to be... Then I will gladly tow it back. But now doesn't seem like a great time for that. I really love... Let's see if you, like, bond stuff. That's right. Good job. Woo! So many explosions. Wait, what else do I need to destroy? What the heck? Hey, man. Shoot. Okay, probably should have, um, got...
Wait, what? Ow. Any normal person would be dead. That Wait, Eden Calvin Cape? Wait. Wait, Eden? Wait, so there's 18 audio tape? Oh, that's really interesting. So this DLC actually adds collectibles. That's something the other two have been missing. That's really interesting. So I guess I'll, I may, I might play all of these if I find them all, these Calvin tapes. Because I found every collectible in the main game, which was a pain in the booty. It took a while and wasn't really worth the effort. Do I need to destroy? Oh no. Duck. Hey, thanks for the ammo, man. Okay, uh, clearly there's another fuel tank down there. Boom, you go. What else am I missing? Okay, I'm facing something. I'm practically facing something. Ah! Ooh, that was close. Hey, I haven't used my explosives to actually liberate something in so long. Water City. Call me a, not just any insurgent boy, I'm Rico Rodriguez. That's actually a really stupid helicopter. Uh. Hey. Uh, is that one of the water things? Boom! It's going down. Okay, that's going on. That's going on. I think that's it. Is that not destroyed? Wait, where's the last thing I need? Oh, there it is. A lot of rock launcher ammo. Are you kidding? Oh, that's it. Okay, well that was a lot of fun liberating. Um, I hope you enjoy. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please like or subscribe. It means a lot. And stay tuned for more Bavarian Sea Heist coming soon. Uh, bye. One step closer to my very own Eden Spark. Indeed, buddy.